The Ghana Grid Company Limited, in a statement, announced that parts of the country will experience power challenges during peak times. Gridco, which is the operator of the National Interconnected Transmission System, explained that the outages were a result of limited gas supply to Tema, which caused a supply gap of 550 megawatts at peak time on Thursday. Manager of Corporate Communications at Gridco, Jifab Bampo, told TV3 they do not know how long the shortfall in supply will last. The glitch in the value chain that has resulted in this regrettable situation. Until these commercial issues with the pipeline are sorted out, we will have some more outages. There will be further outages during peak time, which is from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. Mm. On the issue of the timetable for the public to plan, she notes that it is the duty of the Electricity Company of Ghana. It's up to them to decide if they want to show all of us a timetable. I, Greco has no control over that. It then becomes ECG's responsibility to manage the limited um, megawatts available accordingly. The manager of corporate communications at Gridco noted that the current challenges are generation related and not distribution related, thus out of Gridco's control. These outages experienced on Wednesday and Thursday are not a result of any equipment failure or system disturbance. Mm. It, it is a matter that is of a commercial nature and that has nothing to do with Gridco. Intermittent power outages were recorded between September 23 and October 16, with more pronounced outages recorded in the last two weeks. The general power needs across the country are at least 3,150 megawatts. On Wednesday, October 25, a shortage of 650 megawatts was recorded, with a shortage of 550 megawatts recorded on Thursday, October 26. Any power shortage beyond 250 megawatts will result in significant outages across the country.